Oh, um, first thing I want to say is this, bro. Happy belated to you. I didn't say happy birthday to you. I'm I sorry. That, I'm sorry. I, 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 no, bro. I had strep throat. I was fucked up. Um, and you did text me, and that was when I had strep. I'm better now. Okay. Oh, yeah. Good to hear that, bro. Yes. Dick or what? Uh, no, I've heard that a thousand times. No, I just had a sore throat. Uh, you know, just, I don't know what happened, but you know, there was, there was, um, there was white, there was white dots in the back of my throat. That's dick. You get that from dick. No, 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 no. It was just, it's pus maybe. I don't know. Okay. Fair. Anyways though, um, I just want to, you know, catch up with you and, uh, you know, I saw it. I see everything going on, bro. By the way. Huh? Why we do this? Hell yeah, bro. You're, you're on kick. Bro, by the way, hey, hey, get Rain a kick deal, bro. That's first of all. We need to get you on kick. I, I've, been trying to, I've been trying to get Rain on kick, truth be told, chat, for a while. Hey, hey, now you have all the pressure on you. Everyone, hey, 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 bro. Get him on kick. He still games. He still plays games. He's still a goat, okay? So we need to get him on kick. Yo, um, oh, I know, Kane. He is useless. Hey, hey, he's definitely useless. Who? Addy? You know him, okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, he's... I've been talking about it. He's cool. I fuck with him. Okay, so is there? You might come to kick if if it works out. Yeah, hopefully. I think I was supposed to get a deal offer today, so we'll see. Okay, well now I want to get. I want to get. It's not just me. I want to get the boys. You know what I mean? I want the boys all stream on kick. I thought it'd be cool. Damn. Because it's like it also fits into my whole little narrative. You know what I mean? Like against all the corporate weirdos and shit. And truth be told, I don't like Twitch. They didn't even do nothing to me. I just don't like them. I just don't like the way that they move. Personally. You can't like them, bro. Look who look who owns it. Like, look at the, you know, the blue haired, like, you know, fake wool people that run it. You it's know just not my vibe, bro. It's like the same people that pander to a demographic they can't relate to, right? Like, I hate people like that, bro. Nah, it's I don't annoying. Political or wait, wait, like look who's calling me. Look who's calling me. Banks. Hold on. There he is. Yo, I'm streaming right now, bro. Look, look what we're going. Look what we're doing. Look. I sent you the uh, oh that's awesome. I sent you the uh, the money I owe you. Yes, we. That's something crazy. Don't say anything crazy. I'm screwed. I know, I know, I know. Um, <laughs> um, fuck face corporate. Okay. Damn. Yeah, fuck face. Yo, from <laughs> banks and rain themselves. <laughs> hey, it's the fucking truth, bro. Um, um, I love you. Love you too, bro. I'll talk to you in a bit. Have a good conversation. Yeah, talk to me later. I, I sent you that bread. Did you get it? Uh, I'll check it a little bit. It's cool. Yeah, you're so rich. Must be nice. <laughs> bro, I don't know about him, bro. He's getting better, bro. Right, so rich. Um, okay, look. So, so uh, the first thing I wanted to really talk to you about, bro. First of all, you know, I saw Corporate make a tweet today or some shit, and that shit kind of pissed me off. Yeah, it's some PR bullshit, bro. You it's know, just, bro. it's just so annoying, bro. Because you got people that really still like. Like watch your guys' videos. You know, I told you, bro. When the moment I met you, bro, I, I watched you guys when you were in that New York house, bro. Yeah. You and and Alex um, and, and and Ricky and every, everybody, just everybody, the whole thing. And, and it's just sad to see corporate what it does. You know, when people go corporate, it's not even under your control. You've been you've been talking about this shit for years, and people yeah, no. people called you crazy, bro. Y'all y'all remember for years we were talking about this shit. But now, two weeks ago, the whole narrative was like he's on drugs, and now it's like anybody who says I'm on drugs, they roast him. It's actually fucking hilarious. Yeah, no, nah, I get it, man. I would the last time they saw me out like that, I was fucking crazy. So I don't blame it. Like shit, is he still crazy? I, I don't blame him. But like, if you just listen to what I said, you'd be like, no, this makes sense because that happens in like every industry. It's yeah, really, it is. Like, think about it. Every fucking industry, bro. It's like every million LeBron can make. There's an old white man making ten million for every million he makes. It's true. It's the fucking truth, and it's like I don't want that to happen to the industry that I help make. It just Facts. hurts. It's, so it's, for me, it's more an emotional journey, you know, about something I genuinely care about rather than like the money and shit, bro. Cause like there's so many routes to just take, make easy money and just fuck off and going off in the sunset, right? But to me, I just want phase. I take phase over money. I'd rather make 200K a year and have phase forever than uh -huh. 100 million and not have, I swear to God though. If I nah, I'm phase, the same way, for real. Like, I, I, no, I really feel that. Nah, I, I, you know, you're passionate about that shit, bro, for real. And yeah. that's, that's amazing. Who are these corporate motherfuckers, Chad? Like, who, who are these motherfuckers the corporate? Who are these motherfuckers, bro? I, I also have to be careful because we live now. Normally, when it's videos, I say and I'm like, yo, but I'm asking my lawyer to look through it and edit it out, right? Yeah. I'm not trying to get sued. I'm on a mission, but I don't want to get sued on it. You <laughs> don't have to help me, like, one that go fun and shit goes south there because it's so bad as they come from. Yeah, but, nah. Yeah, now nah, you gotta be careful. Say, nah. Yeah, so I can't name drop, but let's look into it, bro. It's not yeah. hard. You can find him. Mm -hmm. It's not hard. Look into it. Nah, for sure, bro. Um, but. You know, man, with everything going on and shit, you know, it's it's rough. What what about that gray situation? So y'all y'all literally y'all literally just she she pulled up to your guys' crib and you guys tried to talk yeah. it out, bro. First of all, I want to say one thing, bro. I said this shit right now, bro. Everyone knows you're not a fucking R. You're not a rapist, bro. I, I know you're not a rapist. No, you're. Have people been saying that. No, because the tweets, the tweets. 
dude, but it was like. It's stupid. Like, I know. I, I, said it I guess I said it because Tensor loved her, and I said like, oh, <laughs> I don't know, bro. It's fucked up. But I said, look, I'm like, I've even tweeted worse than that, and just being. Yeah, nah, like, bro. The internet was so different back then. So if you want to hold it against me, fucking go ahead. No, you're not. Nobody can, bro. It's not right. Look, yeah. bro. You you grew up on Call of Duty. That's your shit. And either you get it or you don't get it. That's why I love what you said about the video. Because she was like, I never grew up saying shit like that, bro. Either you, you get, get it, it or you don't get it. Like, every game yeah. chat consisted of people screaming the hard R and crazy shit, bro. Like, if you know, you know. It's that type of thing, bro. If yeah, you but, but even at the end of it, bro, it's more I wish that, like, she just take it as, like, a route of education instead of getting, like, offended by it. I don't want her to get offended or her. Even after all this, like, I don't care, bro. I just want everybody to see that, like, bro, I tried. I tried to be nice. I was understanding fucking composed i was chilling the whole time bro when she just, like got so emotional about it let me ask you let me ask you i know i know where you've been going through it for if you guys don't know i mean you guys all know rain was fucking in a wheelchair for a couple of years now you're fucking can you can you can you jump now can shit can you do some yeah, jump? yeah I, can, I can jump i can like fake jog and shit too but it's like okay but weird. but it'll, yeah, yeah, yeah okay all right all right no not yet not yet all right we'll get there soon um but you know my thing is it's just like when she made that comment how do you feel about that because I, I nobody asked you i, I want to ask you when she made that comment oh, how did you feel about it be honest be honest on yeah my mother's life i was so annoyed motherfuckers trying to make me a victim i'm not mm. no damn victim bro i like bossed up and went through that shit and i fucking suffered for two years I'm not afraid of some someone calling me something on the internet or saying some shit that don't yeah. affect me. You can't like my, my skin too tough for that now. It's in, yeah. fucking impossible. Plus, I'm in permanent pain every single day. You think I'm like dealing with a random bitch's opinion? I don't give a fuck, dog. <laughs> oh, so yeah. it's like, and I really mean that. Like on my mom's life, I mean that. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. By this shit. It's like kid shit. Whenever I it's one of the other. Like, now nah. I'm not tripping. Like it doesn't bother me. Like why am I gonna be mad that you don't have IQ? Like what the fuck does that change? Like, the internet is much different when you first started this shit, bro. Now, now that's yeah, what, but bro, uh, but bro, you've been doing it for so long. The internet now, bro, the, the top comment is always something negative. And you know that now, but back then it wasn't that. You know it wasn't that. And honestly, yeah. the YouTube comments chat and, and rain, positive as fuck still. Nobody on YouTube is on that shit. It's just really like, you see it in, in the streaming community, you see it on Twitter, and you see it on TikTok. It's just so negative constantly yeah. and it that's it's shock value it's all shock value and shit um but i just i just thought it was funny how when people bring up tweets from 2013 you were fucking a kid at that time bro you know what i mean like you can't bring up tweets from that time and shit you, you know you, you, you can't i don't know that's just I the fact that that's the best they got though because i was actually like not tripping on it but i was like damn what if people like really think of something but i'm like dude it's a fucking 2013 tweet no one's gonna trip like that right but that's a hey, keep digging i guess not oh. exactly nah bro but i mean she said she was leaving phase is grace gonna leave phase don't care don't know not much <laughs> like i don't care like whatever happens happens you know what i mean all right bro so look. She was. Let's, see if she, let's see if she stands on what she says like i do let's see it <laughs> <laughs> she said barbecue me i'm ready i said all right george foreman and she fucking just couldn't take it jeez okay so look bro what is your ideal because now everyone is on the same page now banks Banks sees this shit now. Yeah. Everyone's vocal about it. What's the what's the next move for like you so, guys? For me, I need us in control. The whole like thing I've been talking to like with the board and all the other people is like if we're not fully in control of what happens, we don't get to decide everything. Pretty much, I'm like if that guy gets fired, hired, because sign, we'll sign signings, no, yeah, yeah. So like, so, so if and if I can't micromanage every department, I don't want to do it either. Yeah, no, of course, really there's no point. I want to make sure people are doing their shit right. And like, bro, for me, because I know that all the shit the phase has been through the years, even if it wasn't our fault, like to save the kids shit, like shit that we really didn't have anything to do with, I like want phase to be as transparent as possible, fucking everything. Even if we're not a public company anymore, I want still to be as transparent about everything as possible, just so the fans always know we really are what we say we are and we like care for them. Like I just, I just want everything to be transparent, just so like they can maybe trust us after everything. You know what I mean? So everything must be transparent.